Hello everyone and welcome to Micro Civilization. This is a incremental clicker 2D strategy, a lot of base building, resource management. There's a, there's a lot of stuff going on here really. Don't let the 2D fool you. This is early access. It actually comes out on November 13th. You can download the demo on Steam, which is what I'm currently playing, the demo. They don't have a price tag on this yet, so I, but I'm assuming it could be around the 10 to 20 dollar range just because I mean it's it's a 2d clicker strategy it does do a tutorial when you go through the demo so it'll add stuff and so we'll just go through it let's see how long we can last sometimes it is difficult there's a lot of you have to get your rhythm a lot of rhythm involved uh, especially with your passive stuff that grows so now we have free space we got some technology here which will which will allow us construction of the wood hut so we'll get that going and we can just click to in to grow so you just click to grow here these are your two clicker buttons there'll be other stuff added later but this is just the beginning of the demo so let's just go on here and get five we have new technology now we'll get that hut so now what this does increases the free space so you click up to 20 and as you'll get passive stuff that automatically does this for you you know you increase this free space they'll start building houses out here and you don't want you know to have not enough not enough population to kind of keep this going because if it like gets really high and it's not going down fast enough you're you'll have increased risk of fires so we'll go ahead and get this tools here that'll start giving us passive passive stuff on the wood and we'll keep going there we go we got six uh, we'll just keep going here we got 10 free space so it's generating one worker and we're getting plus one per second now and as you use that worker I think that will go down so one affects the other. This is why I kind of like this game. It's, it is somewhat casual. Not a lot of, not a lot of intense stuff happening. Oh yeah, we need to get go ahead and get uh, some more huts. You got to be careful. Got to be careful. There we go. We should be good. Now we're getting that one per second. So we'll just let that go. Uh, we hopefully here. Oh here we go. There we go. Now we're getting one per second on the wood. We got that technology done. We got to get 20 population for this star, which is like click it, and it'll give you a boost. So we'll go ahead and get the copper there, so we can go ahead and start building spearmen. And as the population goes up, that free space will go down, and they're starting to build some houses, some little huts here. And sometimes, it, oh, so we got 20 here, so now we can click that, reach 20, and it gives us a boost to research. So now it's like 2.9 percent, 2.9 per second plus 25 percent as well looks like it so this is going to be done a little faster let's go ahead and just get a little increase on that population there we go and you say they just start running around doing stuff automatically it's really fun so now we do have a new option here let's first get some new so we can get cattle here uh, which will get plus two per second uh, we'll probably go ahead and get that that'll help and now we can go ahead and go on to quest. So we had, this is our world map, and you know I'm sure it, it'll expand all the way down here when you get into the late game. I don't know if we'll get to the late game here, but we'll we'll just go as far as we can until we crash, I guess. We'll go over here, and we'll have a 35% risk. I don't know if I want that right now. We can go over here to visit tribe. Three option choices, so we'll have to choose which option we get. It's usually decent. So we'll draw a random dilemma and we'll convert this to a village. So let's start that quest. That's easy. Well, I want to start off with an easy thing right now. So we'll just go ahead and get some spearmen. Let's go ahead and build one. You got to click, 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 click up all the way up to 90. There we go. So we got a spearman. I think it's really cool that, you know, it's on Steam. One guy has developed it. It's just, I think it's just one guy. So this is nice little concept of a game. It's casual, not a lot of not a lot of action involved. Growing your civilization and dealing with events with clicks. So we'll just yeah, we'll just go ahead and increase, and we'll just wait. Oh yeah, we our quest is done now. We have a random thing here, so we do have some stuff we can choose. We could gain 240 gold, and the gold will I'll, I'll show you what that does later uh, when we get some but I don't really know if I want to do this 40% risk for five minutes don't I'm not really ready for that I don't want to lose a spearman so I guess we'll just take the plus plus 1.5 per second for five minute gain on on that so we'll just let these quests are actually done with that one so let's go ahead and choose another one 
Uh, we can do we can do this again. Go to st uh, stage to a four, or we can go up here and do a level four war crisis. Or we can. That's going to be thirty five percent risk though. Why not just get this like two out of four? Let's get that halfway done. Why not? That is done. That technology. We got cattle. Now I want to go ahead and get lumber lumber mill going. Whoa. All right. We're going to have to watch it now because that's free space. You don't want that to go down, which is a good thing I'm doing the lumber mill because that's going to increase the passiveness of of the wood. It'll take away a lot of the food. It'll take away some food, but 6.4 per second I think will I think we'll be fine. It shouldn't take it down that much. We got 50 now, so we'll go ahead and get that one, which will increase oh Wow, that is moving pretty quickly. So we have a war crisis, six plus sixty, but we'll get. Oh, I don't want that. Uh, let's get the gold. Let's get plus three. That'll be yeah. That'll be fine by me. Now we have the gold, so you can pay uh, cost the twenty to increase the food, pay the sixty to increase the lumber shipment, or the research gram. Here's our other thing. You do get these uh, heroes. So we have Beatrice Gambill. They have different shapes, so we have one for each shape that you can put in. So that gives a plus seven damage. Put him in there already. Might as well. I don't have anybody else. I want to go ahead and start getting walls because that helps, especially when you have one of these events happen. I think we're doing all right. We got 43, so we're not we're not increasing too fast, and our population is keeping that at bay. So we actually got the walls now, so the hill for it. Uh, I would like to go ahead and get a pottery because once you get that and that activates, I do have a worker to use, you can get three spearmen. That would be nice. And I think we'll be fine. I don't think we'll use up as much resources. Three out of four. Now we can do a wonder here. I think we might be ready to to try this one, the barbarians. Uh, I think we'll just try it. Why not? I think we'll be all right. So now every time it fills up, I get two population now. Oh, I've reached 100, so let's go ahead and get that. So let me know what you think in the comments about this game. Oh, here we go. Combat with the level 4 Barbarians. They are, they are relatively easy. Uh, so let's, let's go ahead and spear, hit at that. Let's go ahead and click, 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 click. Use that spear. Boom, now they're done. All right. Good. Oh, this is the hero, so we get a hero there. So we get more gold. Now we can do... Ooh, so we can get... Uh, we get that. Let's get the lumber. Because we're good on we're good on food right now. Now we do have another guy here. We have two actually, so we have the circle one. Uh, let's see, 34 percent. Now this is the auto the autonomous skill, which we will go into that I guess once we get there because I think it's getting ready to happen. Let's swap. Oh, look at that guy. That guy's good. Prevent risk cause crisis for a hundred. So we got a hundred of those auto clicks, and if you click it, it'll these numbers will change down here, so try it. Yep. As you can see, it gets a little faster. And then we'll just take it off because I want to save them. Because you want to use those at a specific time, I believe. Let's go ahead and do the three out of four here dilemma. Let's, let's do that. Or you can toggle auto, autonomous mode button to slowly convert tokens into auto clicks. So those are auto clicks. And with this, this little icon, we have dense multipliers, adjustment multiplier 100%. So we get two workers. Prevent risk cause crisis, so we can use that whenever we have a crisis. Let's see, what do we have here? Ooh, 60 vagabonds. Vagabonds increase disease risk. Oh no, but will slowly merge in when housing is free. Well, I, I have a lot of free space, so I think that'll be fine. <laughs> Uh, we got our granary now, which is nice. Let's go ahead and get... I want to get the pickaxe. We'll get some stone. Now I need to build the dry storage. Get that. Let's go ahead and... Oh, we got a charge to use. Boom, and it gives me 240. So now that's done automatically. That's why I like having that. And now we have our granary going. We're still getting plus 1.5. If I take that down, as you can see, now we're getting in the negative. So I don't want to do that just yet. Do I want to do that again? Or do I want to do this one? It's going to be 35% risk. However, I can click that. Can I click this and decrease the risk? Let's just hope it doesn't cause a ruckus. And it is rather, I mean, it is rather long. So, oh, we have a fire. Oh, I st oh no. Well, let's go ahead and... 
we'll go ahead and use our hit. I want to get the block, and it stuns it. See, it stuns it because it helps with the. I think we'll be fine on this. We got to keep keep going. Let's increase. Come on. Hit it again. Uh oh, we got a building done. Oh no. We got 17 free space, so that kind of helped take it down a little bit. Uh, hit that spear. There we go. Crisis averted. Another hero. We got more wood so we can click that down. Alright, now we're stable. Plus 24. Ooh. When lumber mill active. Oh, wow. Okay, let's get that going. Get some stone production too. But I'm still negative 0.9, so I want to. I don't want to do that just yet. Increase the spear here. Uh, let's. We got the pickaxe, so we'll get some more stone there. Let's do the flower. Sure, in the game, you're going to have a lot of these heroes. Looks like you can actually get different tabs as well. But you can. You have recipes here. Uh, so you can. Oh, looks like you can. It gives you some recipes. Single common hero of color or shape. And you can buy these. Some of them are free, apparently. Yeah, you can buy these for some gold. Random rare hero. That's a thousand. How much do I have? I got nine. <laughs> I got the flower. Uh, we can get a barracks code. I want to get a barracks. I could use this, the forced labor. Uh, let's. It's gonna be. It's gonna be some risk. However, we can hopefully prevent risk crisis. Yeah. We, so we did that. Minus two workers. So that is. Hopefully that'll go down. Crisis prevented. Wow cool very cool what do we got encampment and crew okay so we got now we got the encampment let's get the f oh i can get three hill forts well now we're finally getting some stone so i don't really have to click but let's just get it done a little faster there we go get another one going oh we got mammoths now perfect uh let's do a wall oh boom oh wow you know what i didn't even need that wall cool Took that out. Got a new hero, and we got some more growth. Now we can. Now we're. Now we're going. Uh, so we got that one done. Let's. Oh, we have this. We can get more stuff. But we're gonna have. Oh, can convert tile to barbarians. Final stage effect. Uh, it's normal. Okay, let's do it. Hopefully nothing bad will happen. But I should. I mean, it should be fine. Let's go ahead and get that other spearman, and we got that done. Now we're getting more more food. We got. I have three fort units. Oh, we did the mammoths. Now we got another hero, apparently. Nice. Uh, you know what? I think I'll keep what I have. Now we'll do the windmill. Let's get that going. We're getting more free space now. Uh, windmill. Let's get that going. And now we got stone production now, so that's very good to have. Uh, oh, we we did do our quest. There's our windmill. So now we can try. Uh, so we can get this tri uh, trigger next ability twice. Next. Okay, that's interesting. We don't have to... Oh, I get 8.3. Wow. And then we can get that going. And we need more free space, of course. So let's... Let's get that. Boom. And then we'll go back to the marketplace. So we got that done. The breeding. Let's get the... Let's get archers. Ooh. Here we go. Nice. That was a nice, nice hit. Nice hit. So I don't know what that next ability thing did, but... Come on, give me some! Awesome. Okay, now we're kind of we got nine percent risk, so we're I mean that's fine. We got two more people to get. We got the square. Let's see what do we got here. What is this? Plus twenty-two. I had to base that. Well, this that, that other guy's better. Definitely better. Plus ten damage. Uh, let's get him. And we'll thirty-four percent click. Uh. We'll get this guy too. Let's change some stuff. And we're starving. That's not cool. Okay, we need that. We can take that off. Or we can use the ability. No, nope. okay, that's not going to work. Let's do division of labor. Oh, wait, what is that? 50% risk. Oh, do I want to do that? I mean, we're going to have to. Or maybe I don't need to right now because I'm like level 7. Is that what it says? I'm, I'm technically level seven. It's level six, so I think we're fine. Convert to village. Let's let's start that quest. Let's get that one done. Well, that's that's increasing a lot now. Wow, 
we can take that down. There we go. That's going to... Okay, now we're getting there. And I can also increase that. And we still could do division of labor. Okay, you know what? We'll, we'll go with that. That's going to be 50% risk. Oh, boy. So what do we got here? Reduce all risk 25%. Okay, that took it down to 25%, though. That's nice. Uh, we could do the... I guess we'll do a level 6 war crisis. That's going to be hard. I don't know. This is... So I've completed that. I can convert tile to village. This will give the current tile new properties. Its current quest will no longer be available. Well, I've already completed the quest. But is this the whole tile or just that tile? I'm not, uh, Let's try it because I'm... Okay, I guess it's the whole thing. And now we got plus one workers. Is that what it said? Yes, it is. We can actually... Oh, we're doing fine now. Okay. Let's decrease that because we don't need that. Let's go ahead and eat some of this free space. Oh, we have an uprising. Oh, no. Uh, let's get a stun. There we go. Hit him. That's a level 8. This is not good. Let's go ahead and get more archers going. Okay, we're, I think we'll, we'll be alright. Oh, things are blowing up everywhere. Let's go ahead and increase that. We're going to need to. Oh my. Come on. Come on. Yep. Give me that. Oh dear. It blew up. They blew it up. Well, this is all of a sudden. This uprising is not cool. <laughs> there we go. I think we're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost there. Oh, come on. That was so close. Oh, this is not cool. Come on, one more. Oh, wow. That is ridiculous. I could have probably used that. That was kind of scary. I was I was close to a goner. We got a hero. We got more stone. Uh, I was probably just clear the forest. Let's go on this side a little bit. Okay, I think... I think we're doing all right there. So let's go back to this quarry. And get that going. Wow, we gotta click on this one too. We have a fire. Look at that. Oh, this is not good. We might be in trouble. We very well might be in trouble. Oh no. Oh no. Stunned it. Oh no. Yep. Very, very likely we're in trouble here. Oh, I don't think I can keep up. <laughs> it's going, it's, it's spreading too bad. It's spreading too much. Okay, come on. Oh my god. Do I have a, I do, yes. That helped. Boom. Wow. That was close. My population is back to 102. Wow, that... Oy. Yeah, okay, you know what? We need to go back to the hut. There we go. Oh my god. We got another plague. Are you serious? Wow. And this is, yeah, this is how you can just slowly spiral out of control. Which is, I just like this game because every, every time you play it, it's a different, it's kind of a different thing. You know, you'll face stuff differently. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I could, uh, I don't know. I haven't even, I haven't really mastered these two over here. I got more heroes. Yeah, it's just, just kind of getting out of control here. So, but that happens. Yep. I think we're done. Last of two videos, but this was, I mean, this is a really good game. I don't really know the price tag for this. I think, I would assume somewhere between the 10 and $20 range. That's kind of what I would assume. But it looks like, oh, yeah, we are done. We are done. All right. Well, guys, thank you for watching. This is Micro Civilization. I just kind of wanted to show the game, see how far I can go. And but a lot of fun. I'm sure they're going to have much more things happen when the game comes out next week. So, guys, yeah, thank you for watching. Uh, leave a like, share the video, and we will see you again soon.